Hi, ni hao, I'm Chef Tam. I'm making masala curry quinoa. I got some uh, ginger and garlic, a lot of uh, fresh chopped uh, basil, shallot, lemongrass. Lemongrass, you want to make sure you take out the dry skin and uh, this is nice and uh, kind of juicy and just chop some in and uh, one fresh chopped hot chili and I'm gonna get some samba, samba hot sauce I got some vegetable left over that I'm gonna use coriander just a little bit and a uh, little bit of the cumin and clove not much turmeric turmeric that I love to use and some yellow curry powder if you have masala paste you can do that we're gonna make a paste first and I'm gonna use extra virgin olive oil instead of ghee butter like that and then we tighten the lid and we're just gonna give them a coarsely chop just like that I'm using my clay pot medium heat cook all the spices ingredient fresh herb for about three to four minutes we just want to caramelize the paste give them a nice flavor the aroma is beautiful smells so good right now I got four cup of mixed vegetable in here Got the eggplant, mini bell pepper, zucchini, and some uh, radish. Give them a quick mix. I will turn my heat to uh, medium high now. I'm adding in one can coconut milk. 13 and a half ounce and then tomato sauce half cup of water just plain water a pinch of salt and some brown sugar or you can use palm sugar just a little bit balance the flavor it smells so good so healthy and you can cook with this recipe with any kind of vegetable you have left over anything carrot, potatoes this is uh, quinoa you rinse it really good for a couple minutes I got Two third cup of quinoa. I want to make this dish a little bit like a wet stock. I don't want too dry. Almost like a stew and a soup. All right, we bring up to a simmer, and we're gonna close the lid and let them cook for like fifteen to twenty minutes. I'm gonna cover up. Let them cook. Okay. Ah, oh, looking good. Yes. That's how I like it. And squeeze half a lime juice. And some coarsely chopped cilantro. Pack with flavor. And a quick stir. 
the vegetable is nice and softened. Very healthy. I'm gonna give it a quick try. Oh my goodness. Perfect. I don't need anything else. The favorite just nice curry, tamori, coriander, basil. Very good. It's ready. Here's your gluten-free masala vegetable quinoa. Please check out my Facebook, Fortune Cooking. I'm Chef Tom. I hope you like the video. I will see you next time. Bye.